I'm riding to lunch today and I'm trying to figure out, hmm, what should I film today? On the way to get a burrito and bam, it hits me. I need to test this hitch out today. I really need to, I really need to put this, this hitch to the test today, but wait, it's a flagpole. How do we test a pole? Pole, hmm, pole, pole, pole. Mm, I got it. Stripper pole. Stripper pole. Welcome to the vlog. There you go, that's good. <laughs> Alright, so yesterday, or what, a couple days ago, you guys saw that we got the new shark tail hitch on the truck. Tonight we're gonna get the flags mounted because I think the poles are too short, yeah, but today right And Lance has got the Lance has got the weed eater. They're they're going to they're going to work. Today we're gonna test how strong the hitches are in the form of a stripper pole. So we, we've got our pole, which is gonna work as our stripper pole today. Um, like I said in the title, if this video gets 10,000 views, we'll throw some real strippers on the pole. Maybe not, I'm just kidding. But get it to 10,000 views and we'll see. But uh, we got a couple different demonstrations we're gonna do today. I'm gonna pass the, uh, I'm kinda scared, uh, to be completely honest with you. I'm gonna pass the camera off to Jake. And uh, we're gonna... <laughs> I'm so scared. Oh, I don't know. That's like... Okay, I'll be fine. <laughs> this broke right now. It's so funny. Oh, it's weird. Really? But we know that it's... Obviously, we know that it's strong. I need, like... I'm not very heavy, so this isn't like working too well. Okay, uh, I think we need to try something a little different. All right. Obviously, we can tell I'm not very heavy. Uh, this dumpster is full, though, and we need to move it back a little bit. So we're gonna test and see how strong the the hitch. Hop, you wanna hop on? No, oh, come on. Little bit, Mo. I'm, I'm like Get on your foot. No, you're good. Right there. Come straight back. Slower. Go ahead and push. Uh, I don't think that's going to <laughs> Put it in four wheel. I, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. Do I just run into it a little bit? Give it a little bump. Okay, let's get a thumbnail first. No, give it a little bump. Come on. No, not, not that big of a bump. Not that big. He's back. He's back. He's back. Come slow. Come on. Slow, slow, slow. Slow. All right, go ahead. Nothing? Oh, my goodness. I think it's dug into the ground a little bit. I think my Ford could do better than that. It's lowered on street tires. We got to get the... Are you going to push it with the lawnmower? <laughs> All right, thumbnail time. Yeah. Oh, it is kind of dug into the ground, yeah. The cooler, that's what it was. Igloo. Igloo. Ig Igloo is a hell of a cooler, I'm telling you. <laughs> well, in the case of dumpster versus shark tail hitch, the shark tail hitch, um, I would say, I mean, obviously I didn't push the dumpster back because it's a little too heavy and my truck is just kind of spinning on top of the gravel, but I would say shark tail hitch came out on top today. I was told to come home and film the fridge in the house. I have no idea why, but that's what I was told to do. So let's go inside and see what the hell she is talking about. What you doing over there? Hi. Don't get the full kitchen. I'm scared. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! What? He's got a knife. I know. Did you not notice? Yeah. I, I was 
trying to scare you. No. I didn't get it on camera. I definitely just scared her. She no, jumped. You didn't. I, I saw didn't. you jump. No, you didn't. I looked back. I saw you jump. You. He's got a knife. Look. I'm scared of the milk more than I'm scared of you. Whoa. Good boy. Is that good or what? What up, bro? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait. Whoa. Yeah? 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 I'm just kidding. I'm, I'll stop. Sorry. That was a good one. Lance, I hope you know when you moved my seat earlier, she is pissed. <laughs> she's pissed. She's like, who the f moved my seat? Gonna catch these hands. Hey, she's coming for you, Lance. You better watch out. So we're, we're leaving Lowe's again, and look what just had to park next to me. The 2020 High Country Duramax. The TIS Forged. Damn, Fox Shocks all the way around. That thing looks good. Let's see. Can't tell what kind of lift kit it's got on it, but damn, that thing looks good. <laughs> like, they're looking, you know, more than what they do. And, like, I think the one I watched the most. What you guys just saw is a little clip of the call, the consulting call, I guess you could you could say, that I did tonight. Um, huge shout out to my boy. I'm not going to name drop, but uh, I think we got some, some good stuff on the way. It seems like when I sit down and I, I go through Instagrams with people, you know, I'm just, I, I want to be able to help you guys. And... We actually we get results so if you guys want me to help you build your instagram organically it's not like buying followers and shit let me know and i can actually sit down with you guys on the phone and we can actually build your instagram because uh, i've found a way that i think really works and it's proven multiple times to work um something else that's really funny this is the video where i cleaned out the back of my truck at that sierra which is pretty cool he commented, I'm driving while I'm doing this. I'm driving, holding the camera and my phone at the same time. Hell yeah, just for you, Mr. That Wide Sierra. He says, you wouldn't happen to have some 2014 Sierra brake pads in the back seat, would you? Question mark. Uh, you're going to need a camper shell before long. Yeah, I definitely need a camper shell because I leave a lot of crap back there. But what's funny is TJ from Capital Cadillac a long time ago sent me a set of brake pads. And long story short, I only ended up using one side of the brake pads. So I actually have some brand new Actually, I only have one side, so I've only got two brake pads. You need four. But yes, I actually do have some 2014 Sierra brake pads in my truck just for you. I want to give a huge shout out to my boy Justin Red Ruby 14. Y'all go follow him on Instagram. I'm real lazy and I'm not going to put the tag under there, but Justin's my boy and he's got some awesome stuff on the way. So y'all need to go make sure to follow him on Instagram. Justin, sorry, no, no, no. Root Red. Red Ruby 14. Go follow him on Instagram. Huge shout out to my boy. He's got a mod on the way that you guys need to go check out. Wink, wink. I'm going to end it on that. I will see you guys next time. Let's get this bread. Get this bread baby. That's what I'm talking about.